welcome to our channel in this session we will discuss the difference between get to message to string print to stack trace methods where we are using all these methods whenever there is an exception in the try block immediately an exception object is thrown to the catch block so within the catch block we are printing some message related to the exception at the time of printing we can use any one of the method now discuss one by one get to message of so this method is used to display only the exception message to display only exception message from the object just to message whatever the message just to that message is only displayed for that purpose we are using get message so string message is equal to directly object dot get message of okay now i will explain each and everything with example first to discuss second one is two string method now first one is get message object dot get message automatically it returns some message now two string method the purpose is it is used to display exception message exception message with the class name with the class name from where the exception is generated so that means if you are using two string method it will displays the exception message along with the class from where the exception is generated so string some message is equal to object dot to string of now third one is print stack trace of so now this print stack trace is used to get complete details of the exception complete details of the exception what is mean by complete details the message along with the class name along with the method name and line number you are getting the complete details so directly you are calling object dot print stack trace of okay now i will show you all these three things by considering one example so series one this is the very basic example we already discussed within the try block one exception is generated what is the type of exception arithmetic so one catch block is there with arithmetic exception now at the time of printing you can print e dot get message e dot get message so now exception is generated observe what is the output in the catch block divided by 0 here this rest of code is normal regular print statement e dot get message returns divide by 0 here what we discussed it displays only the message for that you are using get message clear now now sir i want exception message along with from which class the exception is generated to string so if exception is generated from which class we know that one this is the class this class only will generate the exception now observe the output java dot lang dot arithmetic exception colon divide by zero that means class name and exception message in that situation we are using 
टू स्ट्रिंग मेथड नाउ क्लियर सेकंड वन नाउ थर्ड वन प्रिंट स्टैक ट्रेस टू प्रिंट ऑल द डिटेल्स फॉर दैट दिस सिस्टम डॉट आउट डॉट प्रिंट एल एन इज नॉट रिक्वायर्ड सो डायरेक्टली यू कैन राइट प्रिंट स्टैक ट्रेस ऑफ प्रिंट स्टैक ट्रेस स्टैक ट्रेस इन द सेंस द कंप्लीट डिटेल्स नाउ ऑब्जर्व द आउटपुट सो फ्रॉम जावा डॉट लैंग डॉट अर्थमेटिक एक्सेप्शन दट इज द क्लास नेम ऑन दट पर्टिक्युलर क्लास ऑब्जर्व ऑन दिस पर्टिक्युलर क्लास वॉट इज दट वन एक्सेप्शन मेसेज फॉलोड बै मेथड नेम वाट इज द मेथड द मेथड इज मेन इन मेन ओनली द एक्सेप्शन इज जनरेटेड फॉलोड बै लाइन नंबर नव यू गाट इट द कंप्लीट डीटेल आर् डिस्प्लेड सो अकॉर्डिंग टू अवर रिक्वयर्मेंट यू कैन यूज एदर गेट मेसेज टू स्ट्रिंग आर् प्रिंट स्टैक्ट्रेस फॉर् डिस्प्लेइंग द डीटेल सो दिस इज द कॉन्सेप्ट while printing the messages by using catch block thank you